And good evening now. We begin tonight with SLED, the South Carolina Law Enforcement Agency. They're working to keep their accreditation through an outside review. They invited members of the Commission on Accreditation for Law Enforcement Agencies to speak uh, from and to hear from employees tonight. News 19's Lauren Thomas has the latest. They assist every agency in this state. The Commission on Accreditation for Law Enforcement Agencies, also known as CALEA, listened to members of law enforcement during a public hearing. The goal, to learn more about the South Carolina Law Enforcement Division for their accreditation process. We look at everything from operational procedures, um, practical procedures, how they actually do the job. Dean Register is an assessor with CALEA and is also the director of the Florida Department of Law Enforcement. He goes around the nation conducting on-site reviews of law enforcement agencies. This assessment is more about meeting the men and women who actually do the job and perform the duties. The on-site accreditation review happens every four years and they are independent reviewers invited by the departments. The last time SLED was awarded a CALEA law enforcement accreditation was in 2016. CALEA has over 480 standards. A lot of the state accreditation processes range from 100 to, to 250 standards. So CLIA is the gold standard when you start looking at accreditation in law enforcement. Now accreditation is not required and according to the CALEA website can cost more than $16,000 for an agency the size of SLED. But Register says having the accreditation can increase trust and accountability. You think about hospitals, would we want to go to a hospital that's not accredited? Would we want to attend a university or a college that is not accredited? Same thing in law enforcement. The Columbia Police Department, Lexington Police Department, Lexington County Sheriff's Department, Orangeburg Department of Public Safety, and the Sumter Police Department are all accredited through CALEA. The on-site review takes about four days to complete. Then their assessment will be reviewed by the CALEA Commission in March of next year. In Columbia, Lauren Thomas, News 19, WLTX.